Have you ever wondered how to eliminate that dart from your dress block? Mm. Hey guys, what's up? How are you guys doing? Hope you guys are good. How are you guys doing? Hope you are coping with the whole situation rightly. You know, I know the whole COVID-19 situation must have, you know, disrupted your plans. But uh, hey, always look at the bright side of every situation, okay? Because today is also part of the bright situation, okay? Because today I'm going to show you how to eliminate that dart from your dress block. Yes, if you have a dress block that has a dart, a shoulder dart, a, a shoulder dart, a waist dart, I'm going to show you how to eliminate it, okay? It's that simple. It's very, very simple, okay? Now note that this method can also be used to eliminate a dart from your bodies and also a skirt okay it's very simple okay so let us get to work and have some fun don't forget to subscribe leave a comment and give this video a thumbs up okay guys let's get right to it okay let us begin okay so I have my dress block here okay I have my dress block here all right so what I want to do first is this okay I want to take my front I will start with, with my front and then I'll cut you my waist okay yes not my waist but my pattern <laughs> the waist of my pattern okay so I'll cut through it like so okay I'll cut through it drop this one side and then I'll cut through this drop this somewhere okay and then i will take my my front bodies what i want to do next is just to transfer my shoulder dart to my waist okay don't you worry if you don't have a shoulder dart on your pattern if you have any other kind of that just transfer it to your waist or if you have a waist dart just work with that okay Okay guys, so see, I have neatly transferred my shoulder dart to my waist, okay? So what I want to do next is to place another small paper underneath just to cover my dart. I have just fill in, fill in in quotes, okay? <laughs> my dart, my, this dart here, okay? This dart here, okay? So what I want to do next is just to cut straight okay i just want to cut it like so okay so now i'll come to my shoulder and somewhere around here close to my side i'm going to connect i'm going to put this dot here okay so what i will do next is i'll connect this dot to each dart legs okay so automatically i am creating a new dart okay so like so and like so okay so can you see oh yes i've created my new dart okay the next thing i want to do is to cut through this dart okay so i'm going to cut through this dart yeah. Boom. so can you see can you see it? i've cut through the dart right and then the next thing i'll do is i'll just close it up like this i'll close this dart up and then i'll mask it down okay i'll close it up and then mask it down so i'll close it up and then mask it down so when i'm done with this i will take this and set it aside okay now i'll take my skirt my skirt pattern the lower part of my dress block okay so what i want to do next is to draw is to remember this is my side and then this is my center this is my center front my side front okay i'll go to the hem wherever my hem is this skirt is stopping on my the dress the skirt for the this this skirt for the dress block is stopping on my knee okay so wherever your length is that shouldn't be an issue okay so you go to your hem 
and then you go to the side this is the side right you make the little dots and then what you want to do is to connect okay you connect to each that leg okay so you have this connect to each that leg okay so can you see it we have created another that so what we want to do is to cut yes we're going to cut it So when you are doing yours, please don't cut it too. Okay, just you should you should just snap it a bit. Okay, but I mistakenly cut mine through. Okay, I'll mask it back like so. Okay, so can you see we have our sketch pattern? Okay, our sketch block is here. The sketch block for the dress block. Okay, so when I'm done with all of this. I'll bring my front and then I'll bring it to this okay so now I have this okay so can you see can you see the can you see you have a space here okay so you want to close that space so what I did so what you want to do is bring your skirt and your your skirt the, the bottom part and then the top part of your dress block you bring it together and then mask it together make sure the center front is is aligned okay the center front is aligned and then you will work with this okay so what I want to do is to bring another sheet of paper okay I'll put it on the nest here okay I'll mask it also I'll mask it down okay I'll mask it down so I need to draw a line from my center front slantly, okay? And how do you get that slant? That slant um, stuff, okay? So what you want to do is the distance between here to here, you need to divide it into two, okay? So you have this, all right? So I will just um, mark it upward, okay? So what I want you to do is your the original waist, your original waist or whatever ways you use to drop this pattern plus the ease or without ease whatever that used to drop this pattern I want you to measure it out here okay so for me for me this is it okay here okay so what I want to do next is to connect from my armhole to this point okay so that's my waist point so remember my waist I'm using, I'm dividing it by four. Whatever waist I'm using, plus ease or without ease, I'm dividing it by four. Okay, so what I want to do next is to connect weight to my hip. Okay, to so connect to my hip. So let's say I have this and then boom. Can you see it? Mm -hmm. So if you if you have an an hip curve, you can just connect it to this point. Okay. So I know we have a lot of things going on here, and you know, <laughs> lot of uh, masking tape and all of that. Okay. But if you have been with us from the beginning, you see that it is quite simple. Okay. So what I want to do next is just to cut off this excess. okay so can you see our dress this is our new dress block without this is our new dress block without the darts okay dress block without the darts so you have eliminated the dart that from your dress block okay for the back you just have to repeat what we did here okay for the front okay you just have to repeat it you transfer you, you cut Go through your waist, right? Do your um, connect to this, right? And then you do this one like this to the side. Remember, it's to the side, okay? So when you do it, you put under paper on the net, and then you have this, okay? So basically, whatever you do for the front, you do it for the back, okay? And then you make sure that this from here to here is equal right from here to here is equal and then the same thing from here to here is equal with the that's after eliminating your dots okay so 
now we have this right now you'll be wondering what about if i don't want a dress block anymore and i want it to be like a bodice and a skirt block okay simple what you do is you cut through your darts okay it's simple okay so what you do is you cut through this this line okay so you have something like this so can you see it without this is without your your um without your darts your seam this is without a dart without a shoulder dart without a waist dart without any kind of dart you uh you don't want <laughs> or you drafted with initially okay so this is it and um, if you have any questions concerning this process because i know i know there are some people that yeah they'll be like ah, hey i don't understand don't worry you can always rewind and watch it okay and if you still don't understand if you have any questions please leave a comment in the comment section i will be right there to answer all your questions okay don't forget to subscribe like this post leave a comment and most importantly i want you to share this link to your social media handle so that you can invite your friends to come and learn okay so we we'll learn together okay all right guys that will be all for today and um, i can't wait to see you in the next video all right do you have a lovely evening day night whatever it is at your end okay so bye thank you for watching okay